Do you store sensitive files in the cloud? If so, you need to encrypt them before uploading. Even if your cloud provider says they encrypt your data, you can't always trust them with your privacy. That's where Cryptomator comes in. In this video, I'll show you how Cryptomator works, why it's better than built-in cloud encryption, and how you can use it for free to keep your files secure. Cryptomator is an open source client-side encryption tool that lets you encrypt files before they hit the cloud. Unlike cloud providers encryption, Cryptomator ensures only you hold the keys. It works with any cloud service, Google Drive, Dropbox, iCloud, you name it. Just create an encrypted vault, add your files and sync it like any other folder. Even if someone hacks your cloud account, they can't read your files without your password. To get started, visit CryptoMeta.org and download the version for your operating system. It's available for Windows, Mac OS, Linux, and there are even mobile apps for Android and iOS. So here's why CryptoMeta beats cloud providers encryption. Zero trust needed. Cloud providers could access your files if they wanted or if forced by law. Cryptomator prevents this. There is end-to-end -end encryption. Files are encrypted on your device before upload. No file size limits. Unlike some cloud encryption tools, Cryptomator doesn't restrict you. It is also open source and audited. No shady backdoors. The code is public and verified. Install it like any regular app. Once you open Cryptomator, the first thing you'll need to do is create a vault. This is where all your encrypted files will live. You can choose an existing folder or set up a new custom directory depending on where you want your data stored. As you go through the setup, you'll also notice the option to open an existing vault in case you've used Cryptomator before. And here's an important tip. Always keep a backup of your vault just to be safe, especially if you're storing anything important. Next, you'll need to choose where to store your vault. If you're using a service like OneDrive, Dropbox, or Google Drive, Cryptomator might detect the synced folder automatically. But if it doesn't, like in my case, you can simply browse and select the cloud synced folder manually or pick any custom location you prefer. Once you select the location inside your synced cloud folder, like your Google Drive or Dropbox folder, you just need to create a password for it. It's best to create a strong password that you can remember. I also recommend enabling the recovery key option during setup. Save it to a separate USB drive or even print it out on paper. Just make sure it's stored somewhere safe in case you ever forget your password. For And that's it. You've successfully created your secure vault ready to sync with the cloud. But how do you actually add files to it? Well, you can't just drag files into the vault folder using your file manager. 
That folder only holds the encrypted data, not the usable files. Let me show you the right way to do it. After creating your vault, simply unlock it by entering your password. If you're on a personal computer, CryptoMater gives you the option to save the password so you don't have to type it every time. But honestly, I don't recommend enabling that. Entering your password manually each time not only adds a layer of security, it also helps you remember it better in the long run. Once your vault is unlocked, just click on Reveal Vault or Reveal Drive. This will open it in your file manager where you can easily add, access, or modify your files just like you would in any regular folder. If you try to access the Vault folder directly, you won't see your actual files, just a bunch of encrypted data. To view or work with your real files, you need to open the Vault through the CryptoMater app. If you're serious about privacy and don't want your cloud provider or anyone else peeking into your files, CryptoMater is a must-have. It's free, powerful, and easy to use. Like this video if you found it helpful, and subscribe for more tools that keep your digital life private and secure. Thanks for watching and stay safe out there.